Yo, what is up everyone, Tiki Gaming here, and today I'm doing a little Minecraft tutorial for LOL PvP and Mace, well, basically any other server that involves money. So, basically, on LOL PvP only, when you come on, spawn in here, and you want to go right over to the PvP kit, click on that, get your PvP kit, and once you come in, if you're wanting money, or if you want to know the command that involves money you just do slash money and they'll show up see I have 490 thousand but yeah I'll show you guys how I got all that money so basically when you spawn in you can go check out spawn if you want it's pretty nice uh, if you wanna get to the place where you get money you just gotta do warp tropical mountains um Okay, so so once you get there, it'll look like this, and PvP is on that way, uh, well, on everywhere you go. And there is spawn protection, so you have to walk out a little ways. So yeah, so when you spawn in, you'll be looking this way. I will recommend to go this way, since there's a lot more mountains. But yeah, let's go this way and see where it leads us to. Oh, yeah, and also you want to have a pick, so, oh, yeah, and watch out for creepers. So we'll go back to warp PvP and grab my pickaxe, and if you guys come here with no pickaxe or anything, you can mine the wood and make yourself some pickaxe. It's, ba it's basically survival out there, but, yeah, I have my diamond pickaxe right there. Then we can just go back to warp tropical mountains. And once we're back there again, turn right and walk off that way. You might want to have some armor on and food with you because there will be a lot of mobs in normal. And you're going to be walking quite away. So, walk through here, you see all these mobs. You can't do anything since there's that spawn protection. And then you keep walking. And there's some dumb stuff happening in chats. Okay, so this right here, this mountain, is protected. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to make your way around it. You're not going to want to go on top of this mountain. It's going to be a total waste. And I'm not saying that you need to go this way. It's just like this way has a lot of quartz, which you're going to want to go for quartz in this. But yeah. So I'll pause this or I'll just cut this out and I'll resume it back to when I get to the mountain I'm going to mine on. Okay guys, so I'm here at the mountain that I'm going to decide to mine on. So basically, you just want to go up to the white quartz and mine it because that sells for a lot. But after I'm done mining, I'll show you guys how these flowers here can be really useful in getting you guys your first 30,000 or 10,000. So yeah, let's get to the speed mining. Okay guys, so I can mine more if I wanted to, but I just wanted to get on to the next topic of this warp. But yeah, with just this much, if you just do sell hand, or... Oh, I did that. Sell hand. I got 14,000. So you just got your 14,000 out of two stacks. And it only took me two minutes. And if you use a full pickaxe, right when it gets to, like, no health at all, you can sell it for 3K. And out of using a full pick on quartz, you can get 150,000, which that is amazing. So... Yeah, on to the next topic, and right down here, we can just start right away. And that is flowers, and it might seem stupid, but if I take one flower of each, I'm going to try and find them all. There we go with the blue flower. Uh, I'm not going to, it's going to take me a while to find all, but here, we can just sell this. I get 250 from one flower. 250 and 250 
So basically, if you might, if you pick a lot of these, you'll can, you can get a lot. So yeah, I'm just gonna do a little speed build of me picking the flowers. So yeah, let's get to it. Okay guys, I have my flowers and I'm gonna go sell them now. And what's good about low PvP, you don't have to like go anywhere to sell them. You can just go like this and just go sell hand. And boom, six thousand right there, just from not even a stack. And once I got a full like three stacks of them blue flowers and got thirty-two thousand. So yeah, I got quite a lot from that. And then yeah, let's sell the hand on this. Got 1,000. Ain't bad for starting. That's 2,000. And then 2,000 again. So, yeah, we can just go back to us warp PvP. Oh, no. <laughs> warp PvP. And then we can just go look at anything that you can buy with all that money. With all that money, by the time you use up everything, you'll probably have over 100,000. So. Then, once you go to the shops and all that, you'll notice why the weapons and stuff can be so overpriced, since you can get money that easy. So, you'll be able to buy chicken and all that. So, that's good. And then, if we go over to the weapons, sadly they don't have prop 2, because that would be like my life right there. Um, You just go over here, go to the right area, and that's the other shop and yeah this is all the weapons so by the time you'll have enough to buy Excalibur probably not early retirement or morning wood that'll take two trips but you'll be able to buy prop 4 which that's good too you'll easily be able to buy noobs blade vanquisher and messenger yeah messenger you'll be able to get but that you need arrows and you can't buy arrows so that's one thing so, if you guys like this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this. I'll definitely be making more videos on LOL PvP. If you guys join the server, I'll be making a montage, and it'll be looking nice with the replay mod. So, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.